Hi everyone, welcome back. It's Phoebe here from Phoebe's Creations. We are playing Living Off the Grid. This is part 10, oh my goodness. And so because it's part 10, I thought we would do a little reuniting and we brought uh, oh. Jeffrey Landgrab <laughs> over. Uh, we tried to get him over here earlier today and he just kept saying he was busy. Uh, so now he's Dana. finally here. Uh. And we're going to have to talk to him. He doesn't even know that we have twins. He hasn't even seen his kids. So this will be um, really interesting. And we're just asking him to stay the night because we don't want him to leave. So he said great. And this is her father. So let's um, discuss interests. And Yuli and Jake are twins, and I haven't actually played this game for quite a bit, so uh, this will be interesting. I want to know if it, if she knows that. Yep. So in relationship, she knows that that's her father. Okay. Let's get the mom out of here. She can go. Let's do a classic painting. <laughs> and Jake has to use the restroom really bad. So he's going to go take care of that. Yuli, on the other hand, is doing pretty good. Looks like she's getting to know her father. And I I thought that they should just know who he is, even though uh, we created some drama by having them with a married man. That was kind of interesting. Uh, let's make a silly face. And everyone's kind of uncomfortable, in a bad mood. And he's really dirty, as you can see, so he needs a bath. And Suki, she's painting. Why aren't you painting anymore? Oh, she's too tense. Well, let's see. Can we use the mirror? Let's try and calm down. Myrna Wodge. Brogy. Uh, looks like the conversation is going well between Julie and her dad. And so for part 10, I'm really hoping to kind of conclude them a little bit, get them to know each other. But it is kind of getting late here, so I think when she's done, she's going to have to get to bed. And we'll let Jake stay up a little bit with his dad. Hopefully Suki can calm herself down. <laughs> All right, so Jake, why don't you get out of the tub now? Let's go say hi to him. Let's talk about our favorite animal. Enthuse about candy. Joke about bananas. I had a banana shake one time. I ordered it by mistake at uh, Sonic. I meant to get like a banana split smoothie or shake and it was a banana shake. It was not very good. But I don't mind bananas. Um, let's make a silly face at him. Uh, we probably shouldn't make fun of adults in front of him. And this is our neighbor over here. I don't remember if you guys remember her, Nora Koch. And nothing really major has been happening in this Let's Play since we last uh, recorded Part 9. I have kind of been neglecting this. Uh, I haven't been really playing much, so I'm happy to be back in here. I don't remember everything that I've done. Um, but Suki certainly isn't calming down. And let's see if we can sell anything in here. Uh, we can sell uncommon parts and all of this stuff from fixing things. Salmon, that's kind of gross. That's spoiled. Uh, I guess we could open this up. What's in here? We found a trophy. So that sells for 50. And we've got some food in here, but I can't remember if we should be selling that because I don't remember what ingredients take for what things. All right. So now Jake has talked with his father. He's kind of halfway. 
and Yuli's halfway too. So they're getting to know him. Hopefully he'll be willing to stop by more. Um, sometimes NPCs will just come by and stop by on their own. Uh, but I'm not really sure how this is going to react for them. Um, and let's try and get Yuli and oh, Jeffrey uh, to kind of maybe the get their spark the back. And but Yuli's uh, really, or not Yuli, Suki's really tense right now. Uh, let's ask him Obina. about his day. <laughs> we'll gossip. Uh, we'll share a secret. Mm. Uh, tell a joke about mimes. Nabor, Hopefully Nabor by talking, Ips, this will work. Unsta? She wants to take Nabor. a bath, Nabor. but we want <laughs> them to Nabor. talk a little bit more. <laughs> Criticize woohoo techniques. I have never seen that one before. Uh, but that's interesting. I guess that's a deviant trait. Let's see how he responds to that. How hispa, Yalu? Uh huh. <laughs> Yibs. I guess uh, Jeffrey Landgrab is family oriented, but that doesn't make sense. Then why he would cheat? Oh, that ruined their romantic relationship. Uh, we can give him the cold shoulder, or we can do a smooth apology. Let's do a smooth apology. Come on. Oh, that worked. Okay. Brogy. Yakalov shoe Breton. Suki's pretty tired, but let's see if we can do a couple more romantic things so he doesn't leave like hating her that way. Alright. So it's up there a little bit, nothing major. Um, let's go to sleep now. It is two in the morning, and yeah, our garden is still really, really messy. And I haven't, I mean, look, there's not even that many plants, but it, between the spraying the plants, weeding, taking care of them, watering takes so long. And I came back into this game earlier today, and like all the faucets and the toilets were broken. <laughs> it was it was a crazy mess, which is how we got some of those parts. Uh, the kids should be waking up any moment here. And we're going to get Suki uh, all ready for the morning. She's unfortunately going to have to wake up. And remember our rule, we can only cook with what we have all the ingredients for. So we can make an apple pie, or let's do pancakes. And we've got some guests here, but we're kind of, hmm. Let's do a party size. And that was nice of Jeffrey to clean up for us. Uh, Yuli's up now. She's going to take a bath. Usually they don't take a bath in the morning. Oh no, hun! You could finish your bath. I'm sorry. I forget when they auto click on it. Then uh, if you click something else, it does cancel it. All right. So let's get Jake up. So he has time to eat his breakfast. And as soon as Yuli's out of the tub, she can eat too. And it's really difficult with living off the grid because they don't have things that other sim households would have, uh, such as like the entertainment pieces, um, just a nice bathtub, um, lights in general, things like that. It makes it really complicated to have our sims meet all their needs. I'm surprised that they haven't like died yet from being like miserable all the time, but. I guess that can't happen, or I'm not sure if it can. It'd be kind of sad if it could, though. Um, so let's gossip with him. Hopefully he doesn't have to leave anytime soon. I would hate to see that. And 
I know that if we got our romance level up, we could probably ask him to leave his wife. I'm not sure if I wanted to do that. Um, so if you guys want to comment below and let me know what you guys think, if that's something that you would like to see, let me know. Uh, so I hope our fondness can get up. Oh, our kids have to go to school. Okay, they both went to school on time. That's good. I think we're going to have to, like, craft another <laughs> bathtub or something so that everyone can take a bath when they need it. And Suki, I know that <laughs> this is kind of bad, but when I first started her out, she was kind of like a little bit above a medium body type sim. Oh, he did not like that. And now she's really, really big. And I think that is because of what food she was eating. Like she was eating hot dogs and stuff like all the time because we were kind of broke and we didn't have things when we first started out. So I don't want to take the low time. So I think I am going to put in like a treadmill or something Me? so we can work out a little bit just because um, for like activities or go jogging or do something uh, okay so he's not liking that so let's see let's try and flirt with him does he like that no nope, he doesn't like that okay so we're not getting to know him very well and I feel like our time with him isn't going to be that well. So let's ask him to move in. We're not asking him to leave his wife. <laughs> We're just asking him to move in. Yes, he said yes. Okay, so I guess it brings me to a loading screen now. I wonder if we can have his wife move in. Oh my goodness, we can. Okay, that's awkward. Okay, so I guess we have a choice. We can just take him, ask him to break up. We can move her in. I think what we're going to do is we're going to take him. We're just going to take him. Uh, he has his other family there. We're going to leave them behind. <laughs> And I'm really doing this because I just don't like having to wait for them to come over or things. It makes it so much more complicated than necessary. But Suki and Jeffrey aren't really getting along right now. So that's going to be another piece that I'm not really sure about. Hopefully this loading screen ends soon. There we go. Okay. So now that Jeffrey's in here, and luckily because we kept them... We didn't get any new funds, so I think I'm going to end this here. Uh, so thank you guys so much for checking back in, watching part 10. Not only did Jeffrey come over for a little reunion, he also decided to move in. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's see where this takes us in the next Let's Play. So uh, talk to you guys soon. Toodles!